Are you looking to squeeze in a home improvement project before the start of the holiday season? Well, don't be in a big hurry when selecting a contractor. Make sure you do your homework. Five on your side troubleshooter Joe Paganakis has a warning about a Cleveland Heights painting contractor. This guy takes money up front, but then leaves the homeowners with nothing? Absolutely rightly. Cleveland Heights police report. He signs the contract, takes the catch, but unfortunately, his signature seems to mean, Larry, very little. So uh, this entire side of the house was to be repainted. Greg Slauson loves his classic Cleveland Heights home. That's why he was so enthusiastic when he signed this contract with Heights Painting and General Contracting back in August of 2012, looking to get the home's cracking exterior painted. But Slauson says contractor William Vaughn took $500 in upfront money and never returned to do any work. We like to keep our house uh, maintained as well as possible and I like to get on things before you know before it gets to be a problem and uh, you know the first time this guy came actually I should have known right away. Slauson says Vaughn even took the paint he purchased for the job. Dozens of phone calls to Vaughn over the past 14 months proved useless. One of the first things he said to me too was he goes I don't know about you but I believe in karma what about you? I said yeah, I do actually. <laughs> and so that was one of his opening statements and it's just been um, one excuse after the other. And investigators are looking for Vaughn. Six other homeowners like Richard Woods have also filed reports with the Cleveland Heights Police Department. Woods still waiting for a $400 refund. I haven't quit looking for you. I want my money. <laughs> and that's my message. I don't care what happens to you. Just give me back my money, that's all. We tried to reach Vaughn, but his phone has been disconnected and he no longer lives at his listed address. Slauson has some short, succinct advice for William Vaughn. Bill, you got to stop doing this. <laughs> so consumers, protect yourself even if you have a contract only give enough upfront money to cover the initial supplies to get the job started. Make background checks on the company with the BBB and the Ohio Attorney General. Check references and work samples. And William Vaughn, I'd still like to get your side of the story. Live on 5, I'm troubleshooter Joe Paganakis.